I want to show you guys a collage of three of the review videos that I've done for my Amazon influencers page. So I want to start off first of all with this beautiful picnic wicker basket. Welcome to Bear Pantry Talk. This is the sister channel to the Bear Pantry Show. This is where you're going to find honest reviews, exciting unboxings, do-it-yourself projects, and engaging commentary. I bought this basket for a photo shoot for my last book cover, No More Leftovers. Hey guys, I'm Barbara here from The Bear Pantry Show. That can be seen on YouTube and Facebook and also from bearpantryshow.com where you can pick up any of my cookbooks, all right? So take a look at this picture. Isn't it gorgeous? I mean the basket, <laughs> of course. All right, so let's get right into the review. So not only do I create cooking content, but I also write cookbooks. And I'm currently writing my third cookbook right now. Hey guys, Barbara here from The Bear Pantry Show that can be seen on YouTube and Facebook. And today I'm unboxing something that has to do with my third cookbook because I'm gonna be shooting my book cover. And it's gonna be a picnic scene. So I bought this from Amazon yesterday. It came in one day, guys. So it has these two straps right here to hold a picnic blanket and that was important to me for it to come with a blanket, okay? Because I didn't want to have to go buy one. Oh, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. I never thought one thing could bring such joy. I just love the pattern, the red and white. And it came with the plates and the um, utensils and the napkins. And look at this little chain, it's so gorgeous. This is gonna look great in my photo shoot. So another important thing for me was to have this part be a cooler, okay? Okay, be careful. Because you can get these for cheaper, but then this part's not a cooler. So here we go. Has straps to hold things in here. This is the blanket. And look, it's spacious. So it came with two wine glasses. Oh, they're tiny. <laughs> Ooh. Gorgeous. So two plates. When I saw the picture, I thought the plates were dinner plates, but this is okay because it's for a picnic. It's to serve little, you know, small things, finger foods. Oh, it has the wine opener here. It has a wine opener. So I'm going to take all this out and stack it in here and then show you guys right at the end what it looks like all set up okay and look guys the blanket comes with weatherproofing gorgeous all right guys i'm taking out the plastic right here so pick up one of these because you can use this all year round all right not just for summertime and springtime and stuff it's gorgeous i'm going to take this out too it has a little thing that i have to break here so I'll make another video in the future. This is just an unboxing, but I'll make another video in the future to show you guys this thing in action, all right? I might show you my photo shoot. So remember to tell them what Barbara from the Bear Pantry Show sent you. Bye. The only flaw that this basket has, if any, is that it doesn't have a carrying handle. So Joe said he's gonna modify it and put a handle on it for me some way, somehow, so we could start taking it to our little beach picnics. So let's get right into the next item. This is a switch that we bought for our Tahoe. We own an old Tahoe 2004, and these switches go out, you know, the window roll down thing goes out, all that stuff. So this one was actually the whole control panel that's in the driver door. So you can't roll the window down on the driver's side. We, the other passengers, could roll our windows down, but Joe couldn't, he's always the driver, couldn't roll down his window. He couldn't, you know, do the power lock. So when he got in the car, he couldn't lock it. That way he would have to lock it with the remote. Oh, it was a nightmare. And let me tell you how scary it is when your window can't go down your driver's window. Um, it's not just about going to the ATM or going to the uh, drive through. It's when you go through toll booths. We went to San Diego to visit a friend. We had to go pay the toll and Joe had to get out his car and they screamed at him because it's time of, you know what, C-19. And they're like, you can't get out your car. And he's like, oh my God. So Joe bought this part hoping that it would work and it absolutely worked. And I made the video and the video has done well for me at Amazon. So let's take a look at this item. So at the start of the shutdown, the driver's side window on my 2004 Tahoe stopped working. At first, we thought it was the mechanical thing to make the window wind up and down because that happens to the back windows and you have to change them out after a few years. Well, we found out through our mechanic that it's actually the whole switch. 
and we didn't change it because why we weren't going anywhere hey guys barbara from the bear pantry show that can be seen on youtube and facebook so fast forward to last weekend we took a trip to san diego california and then when we had to pay the toll i realized that my husband joe had to get out of the truck to go to the window and pay the toll they didn't like that not with what's going on in the world today and so he couldn't put the window down and that's when i realized that if you can't roll the window down if you get pulled over you might look like you're non-compliant and if you open the door to tell the officer that the window doesn't work, well, we all know what could happen. We ain't talking about that. So I decided to spring for the thing and it came today. So let's go to the car to have Joe swap it out and fix the window, the door, the locks, everything. Let's go to the car. Joe popped open the panel by using a screwdriver and then he unplugged one set of wires already. So it's two sets of wires that goes to plugs that plugs into the switch. Now this one is kind of hard because it's been in there for so long it's fused in there. If you think you're going to forget where the wires go, just go ahead and record with your smartphone so that you can be sure to put the wires back at the right place. But one is big, one plug is big and the other one is small. So it's pretty straightforward. Just plug the two back in and then now we're going to test to see if the windows work. Yes, the window works. Try the other window. Go well, down with this one so we can get the other so one. The other. There you go, now do the other one now. <laughs> oh, this still works. Right? It's funny what some working windows can do. And now we can control the windows and the doors from the driver's side part of the SUV. I'm so happy that it's working guys. So if your window won't go down or up and your locks won't work and you have to enter the truck with the key, then you know that it's that switch. Go ahead and switch it all. Tell them what Barbara from the Bear Pantry Show sent you. So the next one that I'm going to show you is going to be so cute because it involves my little weenie. We have a beautiful black lab. Her name is Wednesday Grace, but we call her weenie as a nickname and we bought little shoes for her because she goes on her walks and you know the ground is too hot you know their feet hurt just like you know our the bottoms of our feet so let's take a look at Wednesday sporting her beautiful shoes I have to show you guys the cutest thing take a look at these little dog shoes it's for my baby my black lab Wednesday yes that's her name Wednesday oh my goodness hey guys barbara here from the bear pantry show that can be seen on youtube and facebook so let's take a look at my son joshua putting the little booties or the little shoes on wednesday's feet isn't it the cutest thing you have to make sure first of all when you're going to order it you have to make sure that you measure around the paw so you can get the right size when you talk about this mention how you should get one size on that's what we did okay one size what do you mean one size so whatever these are yeah whatever you, whatever it says to measure mm -hmm. so you think this is like a three you got like mm -hmm. a four what do you measure it they have it on the thing when you go buy the okay. shoes they have like a little guide and then when you put them on make sure that the paws are going in correctly you don't want it to go in all twisted up right and then you just kind of put the velcro over them and of course she's gonna walk weird at first take a look <laughs> That's the funniest thing, right? So let's take a look at Joshua walking her at the park. She's going to get used to it. Don't worry. We've got the rain ones too, the galoshes, but it doesn't rain too much in California. So I'm not going to show you that one right now. I wanted to show you these ones. So whenever the weather is above like 75 degrees and it's too hot on the ground, Joshua will put these shoes on to take her on her walk because their little paws are like the bottom of our feet. You know, it's tender and it's going to get burned. So you want to pick these up for your dog. All right. So remember how to measure and then use them when you get them, use them. Okay. And remember what Barbara from the Bear Pantry Show sent you. Bye. 
Oh my goodness, wasn't that so cute? I hope that gave you some joy in your day to see that dog gallop in her shoes <laughs> or even when she was walking like a robot here leaving the house. You guys, I hope that you are enjoying these collage videos from the videos that I've you know produced for Amazon because I really love putting them together for you to tell a little story. I hope that you will like this video. If you liked what I produced, share it. Uh, leave me a comment. Don't forget to subscribe. And of course, just view the video. That's all I ask. Just watch it. Put it on in the background and let it run. You guys, thank you so much. I'll see you in the next one. Au revoir. Thank you for making it all the way through to the end. Please check out my primary channel, which can be found right here on YouTube. It's called The Bear Pantry Show. Also check out my website, bearpantryshow.com, so that you can pick up a copy of one of my three books. Also remember, we are not buying this book that's being sold on Amazon. Why? Because my distributor is ripping me off. Thanks guys. Make, 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 make,